So what are we making? Um, one of these things is going to take a long time. Actually, a lot of them are going to take a while. But the longest one is we're making homemade apple cider, which I've never made. I love. It's going to make my house smell amazing. Um, and we're going to spike it. Um, so towards the end, we'll be able to drink that. We're making a Bush Noel cake, which if you've ever seen or heard about it, it's like one of the hardest cakes to make because you're basically making a light fluffy cake and rolling it. And then we have um, a prosciutto wrapped pork loin and inside the pork loin, we're stuffing it with apple rice filling. We have four types of apples, okay? These just say Gee Whiz. No, they're Fiji apples, not Fuji. They are Fuji. <laughs> Do I need to take the core out? Look at look at the look at the photo. Look at the photo. Look at the photo. Does that look? Look at that beautiful medley. Does that look like they took the pit out? No, it did, or the 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 core out. Fuck it. I'll put. I'll take the core out. You know what? I'll just do this. Here's what I'll do. Right? Prom fucking solved. Seeds aren't poisonous. Lamail. Hey Google. Are apple seeds poisonous? Apple seeds contain a plant compound known as amygdalin. It is harmless when intact, but when the seeds are damaged, chewed or digested, amygdalin degrades into hydrogen cyanide. This is very poisonous and even lethal in high doses. That's my new favorite insult. You know what, you bitch? How about you just go and eat a bunch of apple seeds, all right? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> eat so many, though. If you really want to go and live to be 150, best way to do that is to train your immune system not to be a bitch. Go on an airplane this holiday season and lick the touch screen of at least three of them. Uh, go to the gym, deep throat some of the handlebars. You're gonna be literally invincible. Just want to show you guys my apple medley here. We're gonna be making some homemade apple cider. It's, um, you just want to make sure they're in a nice rainbow arrangement because it makes the flavor more even. Cover with water, leaving about an inch or two of space at the top of the slow cooker. Wait, I need to add my cinnamon and my whole cloves. Is it a tablespoon? I'm not gonna look and double check. <laughs> that was, okay. Four, then f what? That was plenty. <laughs> Are we good? Are we banging? We're banging. Using LA tap water, by the way. Because we're just going to cook out all the impurities, right? Now what? <laughs> oh, my oranges. All right, what's the best way to do this? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> These are blood oranges. <laughs> I should take the sticker off this one, though, huh? Sick. Okay, step one done. And with minimal problems. So I'm going to make a bouche de Noël, line a 10 by 15 inch jelly roll pan with parchment paper, preheat oven, 375. God, I hate baking so much. Combi whipped cream, half cup confectioner sugar, half cup cocoa, and one teaspoon of vanilla until thick and stiff. Ew, oh man, that's viscous. Holy shit. Ugh, I mean, it is heavy cream. Half a cup of Unsweetened cocoa. Oh, look at that fucking vape. <laughs> oh, I'm a genius. Look at that. Look at me. Let's sprinkle it on there. Half a cup of confectioner sugar, one teaspoon of vanilla until thick and stiff, then refrigerate. So is this more fine than powdered sugar or less fine? Less fine, right? The same? What the fuck, dude? I <laughs> But I have a whole bag of powdered sugar in my fucking... Oh, I've spent so much money on things that I don't need. And then a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Right. Oh shit, well, it's gonna be super vanilla-y. You've been training for this your whole life, brother. With thick and stiff peaks, right? I thought it would mix a little faster. Fuck it. Look at that. Look at the speed. Use wrist? But my wrist is weaker than my forearm, brother. You know what? Shut up, guys. It'll work. Come on, get off the sides. You like that? Shit. <laughs> no. Whatever, the show must go on. I don't think it can get much thicker, man. Like, look. You know? Se like, seriously. Is this not thick enough? <laughs> it didn't even move. Ugh. All right, look, guy, I can, I can make, I can fucking part it like Moses. All right, there's no way this ain't done. We're good. We're banging. Mix egg yolk with a half cup sugar until thick and pale. Eh, this, this, eh. Shit, that's egg white. Yeah, you know what? 
Fuck. Oh, shit. <laughs> Wait, again, bro, you, all right, whatever. I'm doing it over here for now. What the f Like I've never cracked an egg before. Two, three, four. How many did I do? That's four? <laughs> Shit. No, that's good because I threw one out. We're good. Okay, all right, hey, hey, hey. Does anybody else do this? Redistribute your eggs so they're even so you don't take it out of the fridge and it's just like. Okay. Okay, and then whisk. Until what? Whisk until... Oh, shit. I was supposed to whisk and then add it in? Start slow? All right, I'll start slow. Oh! Yo, oh, look at the speed! Peaks are for the egg whites, not for the yolks. Yeah, you're right. So I only have five eggs now. We'll just make the most of it. Whip eggs in a white, or whip egg whites in the soft peaks and then gradually add a quarter cup sugar. Mm, this is gonna take a while, huh? Or will it? Still needs to keep going, right? This is fucking awful. I will never make a cake again. It's easier with machine. I'm a machine. Who? They didn't have machines back in like ancient Greece. Who decided to make cakes the first time? Oh, that's how you do it with your right hand. Are we there yet? I'm actually sweating. I swear to God, we gotta be close, huh? Look, look at it. Like it's fucking, look at it, all right? It's, we're peeking. Immediately fold the yolk mixture into the whites. Dude, it's so thick, fuck. What is fold? How do you fold? Holy shit, that was tough. All right, now what? Oh my God, I'm out of breath. Oh wait, there's a bunch of, ooh, uh-oh. All right, we're good. Get in there, 10 to 15 minutes. Oh, I need to cook the rice. Okay, what if I cook the rice now? I got Spider-Man's favorite, Uncle Ben. Um, oh, hell yeah, I can microwave it? I'm not a bitch, this is shitty cooking. Oh, wait, they have seasoning. Oh. <laughs> so look, the seasoning is in a packet, but the rice is not. All right, I'm gonna assume that we need to make this like, Probably could have done this in a better way. It said chopped apples. I'm dicing them. Is there a difference? Go small. I think I need to go a little smaller too. I'm gonna cut these in half. Just fucking cut the apples, bro. Like, do your job. It's supposed to be springy when touched. I mean, it's burnt on the edge, but whatever, right? Like, it's not pretty, but it is what it is. We, we, we what? We put, we put the, we put the, we put this on, we put this towel on top? Right? Put the towel on first, then we flip it, or what? Fine, fuck it, dude. We take it, and we go over here. God, you guys gotta be able to see this. Whatever. What? Oh, shit! Oh! Bitch! What's good? What's good, bitch? Mm. Okay. Okay. How do I roll it? It's There's too much on the outs. There's too much fucking extra. Fuck. You're literally gonna have to unroll the towel to get the towel out? Well, you stupid fucking two head, how do you think I'm gonna fill it? Huh? You think I'm just gonna not fill the cake? I have to unroll it to fill it and then I roll it back up. Three minutes combine that, a third cup of chopped fennel. So let's chop some dill up. Like, like this? What's the big deal, dude? Dude, I'm, I'm making some, I'm making pork loin weed rolls, dude. Pork loin blunt, bro. It's gonna be fucking sick. Get out of here. Move. All right, I did that a little too hard, but whatever. God, my hands are looking, uh. All right. This is mince, but it's not very mince. I need a slap chop. One sprig of chopped rosemary. I chopped this shit up and I eat it? Not the stem? All right. I have trouble cutting like 
herbs and shit. Oh, my knife is so dirty. Not dirty, it's just covered in shit, you know? So what, I missed a bit. Uh, now what, and mix it? Got about five more minutes, maybe 10. I mean, isn't it kind of already butterflied? It is, oh, wait. I guess we're making two. Oh, so what should I do here? Just, I'm, I'm, I'm making two. Those are two whole loins, butterfly each one, otherwise it'll be too thick and take longer to cook. That's what I thought. This is so much meat. Pretty even, doesn't seem too thick. Those are some deep scores, I ain't gonna lie. That knife is so sharp. I know, I forget what it's like to have sharp knives. Unroll the cake, spread filling to within one inch of the edge, roll the cake up with the filling inside, place seam side down on a serving plate, refrigerate until serving, dust with confectioner sugar before serving. Okay. It cracked. But, not the worst, you know? This is the only part that it cracked, but okay. Oh, fuck. So I'm pretty sure this end was the end that I started with over here. So should I start with that? Fuck, the crack on the edge is so bad. I mean, you can see it. This, this is the only crack that I had. You see what, it's so bad. It's so sad looking. Well. I think pretty good. But it's pretty good. The cross section isn't that pretty. The majority of this is good. If this didn't crack, it'd kind of be dope, right? Like it would kind of almost work. It would, you know, and then I put too much filling in towards the other side. Not bad for the first, and we're gonna cover this bitch in sugar. Where'd the crack go? Who knows? Look, look. <laughs> That just goes to show you, man, you can be an awful cook, shitty cooking, and like, <laughs> Mary Crimbass. <laughs> prosciutto, 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 prosciutto. Ah, oh, that's a, look at, oh, ooh, ooh. Shit, these aren't like big enough slices. I didn't go to like get the store-bought slices. I went to a butcher and he gave me great, like this is good, prosciutto, but it's not necessarily what I needed. Top with the remaining sage. I need to dice more sage and then lay one of the loins on it. Hmm. Can't help but feel like not a, a wide enough, whatever. Let's Subway sandwich it. It's so, oh my God. It'll be cool, I promise, I swear. Okay, it's not bad. It's not great, but it's not bad. Flip it over. It's not bad, it just, you know? Could be better. All right, so for this one, how do I, all right, so how am I gonna pound this noodle with my fists? Just like. Shit, no, I needed to put the prosciutto down for, eh, it doesn't matter, it's all raw. These scores that I made on this one were way too deep, like straight up too deep, but whatever. And I don't have enough parma or I don't have enough prosciutto to wrap it, but chop the remaining apples, fennel, onion, and celery and plate. What do you mean remaining celery? I do have celery. I'm gonna have this clove of garlic. Can I do this? Just put these two in here like this. It's not gonna cook, right? This is just for like added aroma and flavor, I guess, huh? Do some vegetables as the bed. Oh, is that what I, I'm supposed to put the salad? Oh, some onion and then put it on top, right? Like put, yeah. Why is the skin still on the guard? Cause I'm not gonna eat it. I don't think, look, mini, mini volcanoes. Wait, eh, whatever. Well, it doesn't look pretty. It just, the, the, I should have wrapped it better in prosciutto. I didn't have the right prosciutto. Like, you know, I didn't have long enough prosciutto 
to like wrap it entirely because it would look really good. Well, fuck you. I didn't need to use you anyway. Hmm. I promise the prosciutto is not going to stay in place. No! Fuck, I need a plate. But, I mean, the cross section? If I had better prosciutto wrap, it would have been, it would have been pretty good. Like, I don't like, normally like eating pork, loin. Like, I love pulled pork. Pork is super soft, super juicy. I wish I had used more apples or like something that was more, um, like the Granny Smith apples were good. I wish I'd used like a mash, you know? I don't think it looks good, but it tastes really good. Also, like, I was kind of sabotaged when I realized they had cut my pork loin in half. Oh, this one was the one that I didn't flatten out. See? I, like, this is super thick, but this prosciutto wrap was so much well better done, you know? All right. All in all, would serve this to friends, not family. I rate it, I rate it in a seven out of 10. All right, so now mash the apples using a potato masher or a wooden spoon. Take a minute to mash all the apples and oranges against the side of the stock pot to release more of their flavors. Um, they're not remotely soft enough to mash. Eh, never mind, they are. I was just using a wooden spoon. See what I mean? Like some of these are just super, super. Oh, it's the bigger. Oh, I didn't get apples a uniform size. I'm an idiot. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, you, the great escape with this fucking apple. Now what do I do? I strain it. So I'm thinking what I do. Oh yeah. <laughs> what could go wrong? Oh, this is heavy. Oh shit. Oh! Ooh! Ooh! You fucking idiot. I just splash it all over my mouse, whatever. Yo! Yup, I mean, that's pretty good. I would say I probably could have cinnamon, the cinnamon sticks would have been good because it's, all right, so it's tart because I used blood oranges instead of just regular oranges. If I gave this to, if I, I would give this to a loved one. This is good. This is really, this is really surprisingly good. But like how hard, like I couldn't have fucked it up. You just put it in the crock pot. Now it's better. Guys. Thank you guys for watching Shitty Cooking. I I thoroughly enjoyed the shit that we made. Um, I would say this is one of the better ones. Definitely one of the more complicated ones. Again, thank you uh, for watching. And hopefully I'll see you guys um, another time for Shitty Cooking. Or not, you know, just watch my normal streams. Um, that's it. Go away.